Hello and welcome to the battery test of iOS 13 beta 7. Normally I don't do battery tests of beta versions. They are notoriously known for bad battery due to possibly extra debugging software that is stuffed into the code. But I have been very surprised by good battery life of my iPhone 10, and also a lot of you have asked for a battery test. So here goes. So before running the test on iOS 12.4, let's just check the battery wear of each of the devices, then make sure that the brightness setting of the screen is at 25%, and then also make sure that auto brightness has been disabled before running the test. If you have any questions on how Geekbench runs uh, the battery test, check the description of the video. So we're ready to start Geekbench and we will do that by just cutting power to all the three devices at the same time. So let's cut the power now. So we now have power back on the devices, let's launch Geekbench and look at the scores. 
So 1,974 the iPhone 6, 2,144 for the 7, and 2,025 for the iPhone 8. And that gives us a runtime of 3 hours and 17 minutes for the iPhone 6, 3 hours and 35 minutes for the iPhone 7, and 3 hours and 25 minutes for the iPhone 8. So let's get these devices updated to iOS 13 Beta 7 and then run the test again. So now the devices have uh, been updated to iOS 13, they have sat overnight uh, and we're ready to get the test started. So before starting let's just check everything again, screen brightness, auto brightness uh, disabled and the battery wear of the devices. So again, we're ready to run the Geekbench test on iOS 13 Beta 7. So let's get it started. Cutting the power now.
So again, we're back. All devices are now powered on again. So let's run Geekbench and check the scores. So 1,980 for the iPhone 6, 2,094 for iPhone 7, and 2,020 for the iPhone 8. Let's check the run times as well. So 3 hours and 18 minutes for the iPhone 6S, 3 hours and 30 minutes for the iPhone 7, and 3 hours and 25 minutes for the iPhone 8. And here you have an overview of the scores. All devices does seem to be performing just as good as iOS 12.4, or as bad, depending on which camp you're in on that one. iPhone 6S gets one more minute on iOS 13, but the iPhone 7 is short by five minutes on iOS 13. iPhone 8 is too close to call. Same runtime on iOS 13, but a five minute lower score for some reason. So I think it's safe to say that for now, even though it's a beta, iOS 13 is looking good when it comes to battery life, or at least as good as iOS 12.4. So thank you for watching this video. Please remember to click the like button and hit subscribe for the channel. It means a lot. Thanks.